Hi guys! I promised that I was going to come back with some more baby buys and just show you what I've been collecting, what I've been buying for baby, okay? So as you know, I'm expecting baby girl. And show you. Yeah. Let's just get started because it's kind of a lot of stuff. Kinda. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and start off with everything that I got from Walmart, okay? I'm not a big Walmart shopper, but I was passing by a few weeks ago and I saw a few things on clearance. I think they're just clearancing out their stuff so they can get started putting in their Christmas stuff. I know it's a little early to talk about Christmas, but this is how these stores work. So I think they were just clearancing their stuff out. So they can bring out their winter and Christmas stuff, okay? So, but anyway, I went back there and they had really good deals on the their clearance item. So I'm going to start off with these hats. <laughs> Look how cute. So this is a three pack. One, two, three. Three pack, Child of Mine brand. Is Child of Mine a Carter brand? Yeah, they're a Carter brand, made by Carters. So, Child of Mine, and I paid $1.50 for these. As you can see right there, $1.50. That was a good buy. So, they're cute little hats. So, I actually bought two sets. <laughs> I wouldn't have bought two sets if they weren't $1.50, okay? But I figured, wow, $1.50? So, these are um, newborn size, and this is three to zero to three months. So I bought two sets. And then I bought another set here. This set was for on clearance for two dollars. It has two hats, just a little polka dot one and a pink one, and then it has two pyramids on there. So I, I always use those on newborns, so I liked that. And this was two dollars and so zero to three months. And saw this pair of onesie here. Three to six months, Chalamine Carter brand, four dollars. This is three to six months, and this is the long sleeve, so that was a good buy. And then two dollars for these guys. Two dollars. Sets of three. Like you can't beat that. And these are brand new. These are Gerber. Two dollars. Just simple little onesies, and this is zero to three months. She probably won't wear this a whole lot, that's why I went ahead and bought it for two dollars. But she probably won't wear this a whole lot because it's gonna be really cold. She's gonna be a winter baby, so and these are zero to three months, but we'll see. So if she don't use them or don't wear them a lot, I won't feel that bad because they're really cheap. These little zip up onesies here, two dollars and fifty cents. It's <laughs> right there. Two dollars and fifty cents for two sets. And these are the zipper ones. You guys know how I feel about footsie pajamas. That's that's all I use on the babies. So I bought two. <laughs> Didn't realize what I bought two, but now I'm glad I bought two. So she has four sets. And these, how cute is this? And this is two dollars and fifty cents. Look like they marked this down twice. To five dollars they marked it down and they marked it down to two fifty. And this is a set. I might even use one of these as her take home outfit. Like that. Look at that. With a little headband on there. And this is two dollars and fifty cents. And this one here, well, this might be too big for her take home. That was a three, six months. This is a zero to three months. But let's see how big she's going to be, right? And this is super cute. <laughs> for $2.50. How cute is that? It's a little pants and a little, little top. And then I bought her some set of pants, two dollars, and this is two set of pants with the little ruffle buns, little ruffle buns and polka dot. 
zero to three months, two dollars. This one is a uh, this one's a little bigger, six to twelve months, two dollars. Sets of two, flowery and what's that? Cheetah, I think. Cute, cute, cute. And then another set here, twelve months. The same thing, two dollars. Ruffle buns and just a little plain pink one. And this was just a little single one. How much is this? 50 cents. <laughs> 50 cents, see? Right there. 50 cents for this one. It's a plain little little pin. And these are all from Walmart that I'm telling you about. And then this little squishy soft toy here with a little teether thing at the end. And this is $2. A little crackle thing. Crackle toy. Two dollars, and then I saw this another time. We, I, all those I bought at the same time, along with some other things, and then this here, seven dollars. Just some bed sheets, the fitted ones, because this is where she's going to sleep right now. Zai is using this crib, but in a month or so, I'm going to get him a toddler bed, just like the twins have one of those. And then he's going to be stuck into the twins room <laughs> with them. So this is what I do. I don't do the the borders or the, what do you call those things that you put, you tie on here? Like the, the rail things? I forgot what you call them. The bumpers? I don't do bumpers. I did that with pregnancy one and two. And I think it gave more problem than to fix any situation. So I thought it was very problematic. So... I've never used it again after maybe one and two, and I think it's a little needless. needless. Only Zai slept in this crib, so that's all she needs. With her pretty little sheets, and she's good. And then this little set here, this is on clearance, $2. And a little matching top. The top was $2, too. Isn't that cute? <laughs> A little matching top three to six months stockings already for baby so already we're in stockings these are the thick ones you know the, the thick ones that baby wears and these shoes my loves <laughs> so 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 cute these I only pay one to two dollars for these shoes I think this one was two dollars look how cute that is because normally, honestly, I don't buy shoes for babies because I don't see the need to buy shoes for little babies. They're, they can't walk in shoes and they can't walk. <laughs> so I just don't buy shoes for them. All my kids don't get a pair of shoes until they're about 12 months old. Not even then sometimes. Yeah, really. But yeah, anyway... There were a dollar. I couldn't pass it up. So I'm like, okay, she's going to have some shoes. So look at that. That's going to be so fun. And these, one dollar a pair, I swear. Look at that. And Clarence at Walmart. And these, I think they call these moccasins. One dollar. And all those that I show you, some of them are zero to three months and three to six months. And these, and these were two dollars. These look more of like a boy shoe, but I, I liked it anyway. So I'm like, she's gonna wear it. I really liked it. And then these little fuzzies, these little fuzzies right here. Look at it. Oh, this one was a dollar fifty. See right here, dollar fifty, little slippers, <laughs> little fuzzy slippers. Oh my goodness! And this is zero to six months. These little fuzzy slippers. Oh, so cute. And then she got a whole bunch of socks. And these, I've never tried these before, but we have carpet upstairs, 
and with the twins in Zai, their skin is so super, super soft. All my kids' kids' skin is soft. And I noticed with the twins, when they crawled around in their onesie before they started walking, their knee would literally start bleeding, like it would bleed. And then it would get so coarse because their skin is so soft and they're coarse carpet, you know? So I saw these for $1, uh, $1 for the set at Walmart on clearance. I'm like, I've never tried these, but I need them. And they are, you just have one size. So it's probably like a one size fit all crawling stage, you know? So it's, it's called Comfy Crawlers. And I'm like, I have to have this. And it's a set of four. So two pairs on here. Pretty purple one and the green one. Don't have ashy knees. Her knees won't be bleeding. Because <laughs> I, he, his knees didn't get a chance to bleed. Because I always put pants on him when he was at the crawling stage. Because I'm like, I don't want him to have bloody knees and all that stuff. That's painful. And look at this pretty pink one. One dollar for this thing. Comfy crawlers at um, Walmart on clearance. And so this is a little blue one with a kitty on it and there's a little pink polka dot one. Yeah, so these are going to be used a whole lot. So I ordered this from Amazon. Amazon is the cheapest place I could find it. And they're huge. Look how big it is. I forgot the dimension on this. It doesn't have the dimension on there, but they're huge. They're like a, pretty much a blanket size. They're huge. And I bought three. So these are 10 layers of muslin um, material. They sewed together and made. It is super, super soft. Like so soft. Oh my goodness. So three of those right here and they're huge like I said super super soft I bought these off Amazon and I paid I think nine to ten dollars and the reason why they're so cheap is because I bought the open box ones like some like someone bought it or like someone bought it or returned it or, or the box was damaged so they didn't bother to ship it they just put it in a, the open box um, department. So look out for that. Those are being marketed as muslin um, baby bath towels, but you can also use them as blankets. So you don't have to use them as bath towel, but I bought them for bathing purposes. So I'm gonna use them as bath towel. So I always make something from all my babies like if it's not like a crocheted hat or something, I always make something, you know? So for this baby, I went ahead and I bought some muslin material. And I bought this material from Walmart. And I wanted to make some burp rags because I like the muslin burp rags also. I normally use the Gerber nappy things, like the 10, like the one with 10 in the pack. I normally use those Gerber ones. I really like those too. But then I had a... Uh, muslin um burp rag with Zai and the twins and I really love this so I figured let me go ahead and get some muslin burp rags but every time I see them they're really expensive you're seeing like one for 20 something dollars I'm like oh I just can't do it so I went ahead and I sewed some by myself okay 